Hi, and welcome to Tatango Spark. Today, we're going to dive a little bit into creating tasks within a success play. Once you have configured all of the information needed to start the success play, you will then hit continue. From here, you'll be able to pick which type of task you would like for the success play to deploy. You can create a task and assign it to a team member. You can request a team member to update information within a specific form. You can update information automatically. So any of your attributes you have, you can um, update automatically. You can celebrate milestones with the team, notify the team. In addition to that, you can also call a webhook. Specifically, we're gonna focus on creating a task. Once you've decided the type of task that you would like your team to complete, you will then hit continue and be asked to start creating tasks. As you can see, there are multiple tasks that can be created within one success play. In addition to that, you can pull in dynamic data from the attributes that you have to arm your team with all the information they need to be successful as soon as they get that success play to take action. Thanks so much for taking time to learn more about uh, creating tasks within a success play. I encourage you to check them out today. Take care.